Hi, hey everybody. Welcome, welcome. It's Saturday. It's one o'clock. It's time for the Color Me Pretty show. Color Me Pretty show. I'm waiting for my girl, Malia, to pop on. Hey, Karen. What's going on? Jay Poe here. I'm with the Purple Posey. If this is your first time watching, that's me. This is my page. Welcome to my page. This is something we do every Saturday, one o'clock. This is a Color Me Pretty Paint show with myself, Jay Poe, and Malia of Mustard Tree Market. It's my girl. It's my business partner. It's my. I run a group with her called Paint Take Over Borders. We're fixing to do an in-person class. I just pinned. The link to our class coming up August 24th, top of this thread. Hey, hey, Erin, I see Melissa. Melissa, oh my God, I can't talk every time I get on these dang lives. I've been doing it for a while. You'd think I'd learn, jeez Louise. Let's get her. Pop me a top, just pop me a top. Oh, I don't know. Hey girl, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, what hi. What you hi. sipping on? Wait. You're looking pretty in purple. Oh, dang. Uh, Arita. A what? Arita. Oh, I love Rita's. I love straw Rita's. Mm -hmm. I made a, a little spritzer, mm -hmm. a, little, a little wine spritzer, a little spritzer. I'm feeling like I'm 100 yeah. years old. So I got a little fridge in my paint studio. Mm. Aren't you uh, fancy? Yeah. Well, you are. I mean, yeah. Got a little fridge in here, and it's, like, full of those little spritzer thingies, and I was like, I don't have time to make cocktails. <laughs> so, wait. Hi, guys. Hi, Diane. All right. So, what you working on today? <laughs> so, um, I'm working on this dresser set that I've got. You know, it's got this massive, like, long dresser that goes with it, and I started it in our group, the Practice Paint Show and the Boho with Depot. Yeah. And I'm I'm doing what I knew was gonna happen. You what? I'm doing what I knew it was gonna happen. Change your whole plan. Changing it up, like the whole thing. It happens. It does happen. But I like what's going on right there. Thanks. I like it. Hey Chassie. So um, hey Bridget. So just a little uh, disclaimer. We have a crazy storm going on here, and we keep having power flickering because we live in like a really old vintage house. And uh, it's probably an antique, actually. So I've got, like, my – this is um, – got candles in it. And then I've got my old-school candle holder over here, okay? And I got my incense burning, and I got a little LED light. So I'm prepared. If the power goes out, it's going to get really romantic in here. <laughs> <It's such> a <laughs> Um, but I'm using Dixie Bell, and I am, hey, girls, hey, Lisa, um, hey, Misty, hey, Bridget. Um, so I'm doing a bohemian dresser, and I'm using, I want the main color, I think, to be this barn red, but I've also got peony, and then I've got apricot, Dixie Bell apricot. So those are my three colors, and then I'm thinking, imagine this, I might use a stencil. What the, I know, I know, I know it's shocking. Um, I was originally gonna do lattice on this, but I just used the lattice, and now I'm like, so I'm thinking I might do something like these little rose flower thing, like boom and boom, or I don't know, something with this little rose flower. And then, hey Mary from Houston. Then I'm going to do this patina, so look at my lineup here. I'm going to use this patina stuff and rust out everywhere. I mean, I'm not going to brag or anything, but, oh, oh, I'm not going to brag. Oh, or my anything, gosh. But, you, know. you got a little bit of dips. I just got it. <laughs> and I just got another Oh, my gosh. Today. But go ahead. But go ahead. But All the right, cool thing ahead. I did, guys, is so um, I go, you know, I go pick in, so everything I get is free. Um, and I got this little cool, cute pair of basic plain, they're really old, nightstands. And they had this ugly little, you know, regular hanging doodle 
uh, handle. And this actually had these weird dragonfly handles that somebody had bought for really cheap at Walmart or something. Didn't like them. So I ripped off this like antique hardware off of a dresser picking that wasn't worth salvaging, but the hardware was great. And there happened to be six of them. So I placed them on here and then I used some Dixie mud, Dixie Bell mud to fill these holes and add a new hole in the middle. And now once I paint them, they will be a set and I've got two of them. So now it's going to be a whole set guys. None of my sets are ever actual sets. I just change out the hardware and make sure they have a similar style and you paint them the same and then Sometimes she's smart, guys. It's really weird when it happens. It's so strange. Well, it's a good tip when you're painting crazy colors because people sometimes can't imagine this matching their current bedroom set, but they can imagine replacing their bedroom set with a whole other one that's this kind of color. So it's an easier sell sometimes, you know? I love Dixie Mud, yeah, no. too. This is the first time I've ever tried Dixie Mud. It's actually super cool. And no stinkiness. Yeah. And nothing stinky. I'm gonna be in my next order. I gotta place. So I have. I'm gonna place another order because since I'm changing up the colors, <laughs> I gotta order more. You're gonna have to get the and whole line. And then also, line. I gotta order. <laughs> I've almost got it. <laughs> well, they. I mean, they help. They help me out a little bit with that, but. Um, I'm fixing to start a custom. I'm finna start a custom, and so I've got to order her thing too. AJ said she loves Dixie Mud too. I am loving it. I I don't like the regular wood filler because it's stinky and it gets so hard so quick that I can't sand it without getting like a steel sander sometimes. And this, like, look at it. Look at how look how smooth that is, guys. Like I know you can clearly see, but this is smooth as can be. When I paint it, you'll never know those were there. And then people will think that I have a set. Yo, yo, yo. Wow, look at all the big spell paint you have. One. Yeah, Mary. I got a lot too. I'm not going to lie. But I'm not trying to show off like, j a one-upper. So she's yeah. always trying to one-up me. I mean, only Malia though. Only me. <laughs> only me. Only you. So I'm, I'm using, so today, so what I'm going to do, here's my plans. I'm going in with Gravel Road over what I already have on here, which I think is like Manatee Gray is what I have uh -huh. on here. I'm going over with, I'm going over with Gravel yeah. Road. Then I'm going to grab me some Spanish moss. Ooh, that'll be pretty. And I'm, I'm going to do some, I think I'm going to do some dry brushing, just Ooh. like crazy dry brushing. Like crazy? Right? I'm going to do some crazy. Like crazy dry like brushing. You have to be crazy and, and then just dry brush and then you get crazy dry brushing. I'm already crazy, so I've got that part down. You I'm do, already babe. there. You do, babe. And I'm going to do the rest. Yeah. Then. Are you yeah. Ready? Oh, shoot. That's not what I wanted to do. Huh. Yeah. Th then I have drop cloth. Mm. I'm going to do the same thing. Right? Hey, Leslie. And <laughs> then. And, and then, then what? Quit keeping us waiting. Tell us. What is that? Grunge, that's that's grunge glaze. glaze. I'm proud of you. Yeah. I'm proud of you. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. I'm just, I'm just gonna do the top, just like super quick, so I can get to the good stuff. We're gonna do the, the good side. stuff. We can't really see you very good. Kind of, kind of catawonky. Well, I'm just doing the, I'm just doing the top real quick. Oh, fine. And then I'm gonna do the sides. The top is boring. Nobody wants to see the top. Right? Yeah, we'd much rather see so, you behind just whop, whopping back and forth, whopping back oh, and forth. Well, nobody, you can, I don't want you to stand my honey. I'm gonna put you close. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I didn't know how to say it. <laughs> nobody, needs, nobody needs to be seeing all that mess. <laughs> so, yeah. So, we had crazy storms here last night. There was a tornado like an hour south of us through town. We had eight. We top you. Did there you? was eight tornadoes in Kansas last night. That is insane. Yeah, it was pretty bad. Apparently, there was a video on Facebook. I need to check on my San Angelo peeps. I used to live there, so I was friends there. 
Don't lie. Mm. You don't have friends. Yeah. It's you're right. All I have is you. Yes. All I have is you. Girl, you know okay. it's too. She's she's good. I can't find my spray bottle. What is going on right now? Borrow mine. Oh, I know where Here. it's at. Here. Taking a quick break. Here. I don't have that no. fancy kind of a spray bottle, okay? You fancy. I'm gonna go grab mine, so stay okay. tuned. Be right back. BRB. 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 So guys, um, while she's taking her little break, because she was totally unprepared, she's so professional. I can hear she you. She uses all those professional terms. Oh, shoot. I can hear you. She's got some fancy Bluetooth thing. Just kidding. I knew she did. I want her to hear me. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I say it to her face. I say it to her face. What in the world? Did my child have it? Like, where is it? He's a turkey. He probably did run off with it. Do you guys have my vinegar water spray bottle? I need it. Thank you. I just like. I mean, they're always coming in my world and grabbing all my stuff. <sighs> I'm back. For those of you that were getting ready to turn off because a depot was by herself. What brush are you using? I'm using the Paint Pixie Dix Paint Pixie Dixie Bell. <laughs> Paint Pixie Dixie. <laughs> I'm using the Paint Pixie Dusty Brush. It's like my favorite brush ever. Yeah, it's mine too. I wish it stayed together better, but I do love the brush so much, even when they fall apart. <laughs> I went I went and bought little um little itty bitty nails to fix, to fix it. <laughs> I've got the nails, they just don't stay. <laughs> and so I'm gonna I'm gonna put like JB JB Weld glue or some crap in there and like mail them back in. Yeah, I'm hoping that I love paint pixie brushes, but they need to fix that model because it's such a fantastic brush. I'm using I still keep using them even though the screws are popping out and they're rusting. <laughs> I still I still keep using them. Because I love the way they paint. Are you hanging yours upside down? Yeah. The dusty brush. Yes, the dusty brush. Always have. Hey, been. fun little fact. Fun little fact. Yeah. Let me show y'all something. This is your daily useless um, information for trivia if you ever need it. This bad boy right here, the buff, the buffing brush from Pink yeah. Pixie. Guess her name. Guess her name. I don't know. J Po did. I named this brush. <laughs> so I got Friedman. She did. She named it. And it's so awesome. I did. I named it. She named it. Because she's cool. Because she's cool like today. that. Yeah. No, so when um so when Josie was coming up oh I almost lost my air AirPod. When Josie was coming up with the um the names for her buffy brushes, um she was like having a little contest like it's called the buff the big one is the buff and the little one is the buffy okay. little one is the buffy well and so i had put buff and buffy in my little comment but somebody put buffy in their in their comment like just by itself so she, she i mean obviously i couldn't name both that wouldn't have been fair so she gave it to the other person so I mean, I actually did come up with the same little bit. <laughs> I know. I want that. I want that buffer feet. so bad. But anyways, she was um, she was asking for names, and she was like, "If I like it, I'm gonna pick it, and you get a free one." And she like, "Funny." So I got a free one. I'm jealous. I want that buffer. Yeah, it's super cool. You can like buff a freaking armoire and like. 10 minutes flat, maybe. Not even. Yeah, that would be so fantastic. I'm going to get me one someday. Someday when I grow up. You're going to be like me when you grow up? Is that what you no. said? No. Oh, I thought that's what I heard. No. I hate oh, the way I can't see right. comments today unless I touch them. It's so weird how that does that when you're the guest. Have you noticed that? Yeah. Cause like, it's weird. Yeah, I can't see them. Melanie, I'm changing. Melanie, I'm changing up the dresser we started together. 
I t- I'm going in a totally different direction. <laughs> I told you I was going to. I told you I was going to. Cause she knows it's true. Ooh, ooh, I know how I am. Ooh, she does change it. Yeah. It's not like I'm taking down the house. Why is it doing that? Can you guys see? Oh, no. Let me make sure. So. I'm saying nothing. Mm-hmm. Why is it quiet today? Why are you so quiet? Because, okay, so I have this thing when it storms. I feel so creatively inspired. And I could just, I could just paint all day long. And it just makes me feel a certain way. And I, I can't explain it. What are you trying to say? I'm just you like, no, I don't want to be alone. I want all of you guys here. But I'm just a little bit in my head. I've got my incense burning and I... All I'm missing is my indie music, and then I'm just, like, in this zone. And I've got, like, my little, my besties here, my local besties, are throwing me a little belated birthday um, soiree at their house. Yeah. Isn't your birthday, like, a month ago? I mean, I'm just saying. I know. Oh, speaking of birthday presents and birthday celebrations. Yeah. Still waiting on my birthday. I know. I need to send your birthday gift still. I've had it forever. But yeah, there's like a little thing going on, but it's all stormy. So I just feel like it makes me want to just paint, drink wine, smell incense, burn incense, and play indie music. And be all up in my head. Pretty sure you're the you're the only person I know that still burns incense. I mean, it's like 1997. What? That people burned incense. No. Who else here burns incense? Tell me. Tell me. Other people burn incense. No, I think you're the only one. Nope. You're the only weirdo. It's not a weird thing. I'm a hippie. There's these things called scentsy now. Oh no. To make your house. I don't want that crap. Yeah. You're not, you're not bringing no incense and indie music into my house. I'm going to bring a truckload of stop them. Every, what is every day. See, br- me is, every day. Oh, my God. Mm. Thank you. Oh God. You can't beat that smell. Gosh, I'm not weird. a real housewife. I don't need no scentsy stuff. Indie or incense are either. $1, I dollar and they are amazing. I get the sage ones. So they're like an energy cleanser they clean the air I just love it I love it you can't be bringing that stuff into Texas okay I'm I'm gonna bring a suitcase full of incense love jasmine scent see look at all these people burn sage see these are my people those are my peeps right there I'm burning one that's right now it's called um Nag Champa, uh white sage, and it is the best smelling one ever. I can't even explain how amazing it smells. It's so good. So I'm imagining where I would have to go in this town to get incense. What? And it's not a good place. It's not a good place. I can't. Don't you get loose leaf tea? I just get it where I get my loose leaf tea and my herbs, dried herbs, essential oils. Like it's where I get my lavender oil. <laughs> I drink Herbalife tea because it burns That's calories tea. and it gives me energy and mental. It's tea. It's it burns <laughs> calories. It gives me focus and it boosts my metabolism and makes me focus and all that stuff. That's the tea I drink. Either that or it's Texas sweet tea from Lipton. Uh, Isaac's right. I did get this this white sage at a pretty CD looking place this time. <laughs> Only because we were picking and we were like, ooh, and he need, he vaped, so he needed vape juice. And so I stopped at this a little bit CD place <laughs> and they had amazing instance, like walls of them. But I kind of like CD places and like hole in the wall. That does not surprise me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with you. I clean all my furniture naturally with doTERRA essential oils. See, Bridget, I'm the same way. I use it for in my interior, my drawers. I do lavender for like um, dresser drawers. And then I might do 
a coconut oil type blend <laughs> for uh, my kitchen pieces. And I'll put some like orange oil in them. Like I like sometimes I put cilantro for mine because I know other people don't like it, but I like the smell of cilantro a lot. Isaac said, I'm like, what in the world's taking so long there? Legit worried. I do. I can spend all day in these stores. At least he doesn't make you go in there packing. <laughs> no, he doesn't even want to go in there. And I'm like, I'm going to go. Let me tell you all time. Let me tell you all a story about my husband. Let me tell you all a story about my husband. <laughs> Yesterday. So um, I had to, I had somebody, like a, a shipper coming to my house to pick up a piece of furniture. He was going to Georgia. And my husband wasn't going to be here when this guy came to the house to pick up my furniture. I know. It was going to be like 8.30 in the morning, okay? So my husband is like, he's, you know, he worries about me. And unfortunately, we all sex trafficking is a thing. <laughs> sex trafficking is a thing in this area. And, you know, there's like things everywhere. Crime or, or whatever. Unfortunately. I mean, it's actually like, it's like happening in the town next to me. Anyways. <laughs> so he's like, you better have the nine mil in your purse, like at your disposal at any second. He's like, you better have that or you better have Dexter on the leash and be holding him at any time. Because if you start screaming, Dexter's going to like, he's going to tear him up. Like the dog, our dog, he's like wolf and husky. And he's mean. I mean, he's like super protective or whatever. And I'm like, babe, it's, it's going to be fine. Like, I promise it's going to be fine. He's like, I'm serious. You better have He's probably on. watching this video right now. I know. I'm just telling the story about how, like, he's protective. Like, how protective, like, he works. It's your husband. He should be. <laughs> I know. And that's what I was telling. So I was telling Malia. I was like, he wants me to do this, that, and the other. And she was like, wow. And I was like, it could be worse. He could not give a crap. Well, you shouldn't be married to him if he doesn't give a crap, okay? That's what I'm saying. Like, he's just be being a good husband. But, um, you know me, I'm not a gun person, but I was all for getting the dog just in case. But I have like a problem where I have like this really false sense of security. <laughs> like it's a it's a problem. I just don't want to I'm uncomfortable around men in general, like that I don't know. Just well just because I've I have a history like with abuse, you know. So yeah. Anyways, I think that but that's yeah. probably a safer way to it's be legit than fear. like it's a legit the fear. opposite. Girl, you yeah, know. and sometimes I'm too I'm too trusting, but not when it comes to men. Okay, I'm fixing go in. I'm finna go in with some dry brushing. You fixing? Or are you just gonna do it? I'm fitting to. I'm fitting to. Actually, I think I'm gonna get my heat done. Cause I don't want to go in. Should I go in with a little bit tacky and wet? What do y'all think? For what? I don't know, should I? All right, let's do it. Let's try it. What are you doing? I don't know. You better not be dry brushing over doing. wet paint. Some of it will be blended in. Blendedy? And some of it, yeah, and some of it will dry, be dry. Like half of it's dry and half of it's wet. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So it'll, it might it might give it a cool effect. If it doesn't, it's just paint. Oh crap! How do you do? I messed it up. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be okay. It's just paint. Oh no! I just threw my plate across the room though. I got temper, y'all. <laughs> maybe if you had, maybe if you use more incense and essential oils, that would help with your temper. <laughs> you know what would help with my temper? A little bit more of that margarita. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to mama. So yeah, I just think going like all crazy, like weird directions. Well, not weird directions, but just like back and forth, up and down. Dry brushing. I don't know. Like how I'm doing? <laughs> oh, is that what you're doing? Oh, mine's not dry, though. I mean, it's kind of dry. I'm just doing what I always do. I'm not doing anything crazy. I'm just doing... Are you dry brushing? I mean, no. Yes, Carrie. 
Mine has vinegar and water squirted on it. Really? Because I got my vinegar water right here. I grabbed it. Good. I always. That's not okay. I'm copying. I'm you. always using vinegar and water. It's not. It's not a technique for me. It's the way I paint. It's different. It's not copying. It's not copying at all. So guys, if y'all haven't heard, the clients are coming to Texas. Oh, somebody from Arizona. So the clients are coming to Texas. I feel like it's, uh oh, baby's crying. I guess that means daddy's putting her to bed. Um, yeah, the clients are coming to Texas. And so guess what that means? Hi, hide your kid, hide your wife. They actually, <laughs> sorry. Yeah. The vinegar can actually make the paint kind of pull a little bit, like separate and do kind of weird, like distressing type things. It can do lots of different things depending on how you use it. What's it doing for you, Malia? I know how it works with DIY paint. I've never actually used it on Big Evil, though. Um, it does kind of pull it. It does kind of, um, it's great for a non-new, non-clean look like I like everything to look aged and old and like it's been weathered so it works for me all the time because I don't ever paint clean smooth but if you're looking for a smooth clean finish it's not your jam but it just adds if you do it the way the like my salt and vinegar technique it'll give like holes in the finish um, if you just spray it on your brush like I do all the time, it's similar to water, but it just pulls it a little bit more. Um, I don't know. I just like it. It does weird stuff. You should play with it, guys, and see how you like it. Hey, Dion. What ratio? Tracy, I'm doing like a 50-50 vinegar and water. That's always just what I have in my squirt bottle and what I just spray on my brush and go in. If you spray the piece, you're going to get some dripping. It's going to pull it back. So if you're not wanting drippy or anything, I just spray my brush, and that's like my blending. Hey, Dion. Dion Woods in the house. In the his house. Busy. So I picture this piece having a little bit more red than it's having. Just start hanging off. I'm just gonna keep Whoopsie. going. Just keep keep going. Um, yeah, going. Gosh, I need to know um Nisha her bracelet. Kiss face, Dion. I know, you need to do that bad. Like bad, bad. Are you guys painting today? Is anybody else painting out there? Is anybody on here about to book their ticket to our class? Anybody going to do that? August 24th? Who's doing it? Who's booking their class today? I think we're almost out of, like, shirts. We still got some. Right. Like with, a handful. With Micah and what's and what's Yeah. Name? Um, yeah, you guys, if you want to book in the first 20 people and get the free ringer tee... Color Me Pretty t-shirt that's super cute. Um, book fast, because we are running to the very end of those. If the people that said last night they're messaging about their booking today, if they all book, we might be out. So if you're wanting a t-shirt, if not, we still have lots of tickets. We're going we're gonna to cap it at 46 people. That's our capacity. So, yeah, I like the fire marshal things you've got, like, free reign to be like, you can only have so many people. I mean, like, I don't know who he thinks he is. Yeah, we're going to try to on my boy. try to obey the basic laws. Oh, Dion, how'd they do at state? They were going to state, right? How did they do this oh. year? They were, like, second high school. Is it raining there, girl? Painting, making molds by back aches. Yeah, she said they won last night. She said he won. Oh, yeah. did they? Oh, that's cool. 
didn't see that. How's that a baseball game last night too, Dion? I was not at a baseball game. What was I doing last night? Nobody knows. What was I doing? Why don't you? Oh yeah, what did I have to do last? Night? Grill out or something? Spend time with your husband? I don't remember. Oh my gosh, I can't remember what I did last night. <laughs> <laughs> well, it must have been a good night. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that is sad. <laughs> Elijah lost his state tournament. Aw. Oh, no. Dang it. Liz, 90 degrees. Well, he's a senior next year, so they've got one more year. Oh, different boys. Sorry, Dion. <laughs> We're talking about different. 90 degrees. Yeah, Liz, it's supposed to be like, um, I don't know, like hot here. Well, it rained this morning. Like, we got a ton of rain last night, and so it's supposed to be like 90 here, so it's going to be, the humidity is going to be like 472. 472. Mm -hmm. It's a lot. Yeah. It's yeah. a lot. Mm -hmm. It's a thing. <sighs> so has, has anybody see. on here used the Dixie Bell Patina line, like the spray and stuff indoors? Because I'm really wanting to use it, but I'm not wanting to go outside, especially when it's going to be storming all week. Can I do that? Am I going to be hazarding my health? Okay, so I tried it on my um, – that's okay, Carrie. We understand. I tried it on my little – I have a tall, like, storage bookshelf – or not bookshelf, but a tall storage shelf yeah. thing. And it's a thing. Anyways, I got doors on there. And I'll like I'll paint and play with colors and see if I like the combo or whatever, and then I'll kill it and start all over again. Anyways, so I have the patina stuff and I tried it. Mm -hmm. I didn't smell anything. I don't know. And I don't know if it's just because I didn't use very much, but I did not smell really? anything. Really? So you think I could use I it indoors with my windows open in my studio? This is kind, of, but you are like somebody who like gets a headache from freaking wood filler. So. I hate wood filler. It's so stinky. <laughs> <laughs> saw that has anybody else used it indoors <laughs> I want to do it so bad I, know, I have the I have the the green and the blue yeah and I still need to use the sea salt they sent me this or the sea spray I've used that I mean everything I've dictated has been you know, it's no VOCs, you can use it indoors, but their patina spray has like a warning, like wear a mask, wear gloves, highly ventilated area. So now I'm like, sounds a little sketch, like maybe I should be outside. But, um, but I'm impatient, you know, you know how I am. I'm a little bit impatient. So a bit. I don't want to wait. And I want to rust this gal out. I think I'm going to put all the stencils on, or the stencil, whatever I do stencil-wise, on first. Because I wanted to, like, rest over the stencils. And then I've got a bunch of gilding wax and Dixie dirt I'm going to use on it. It's going to be so much fun. I'm so excited to do this piece. I've been planning this in my mind forever. I made it. Uh-oh. What did you do? It don't matter. What'd you do? I'm like, what are you talking about? What smell? I know, Isaac, right? There's like no smell to it. I look, I went to go dry brush this way and I went, whoop. I did like a swoop. Can you see it? It's like crooked. Oh, that's okay. Spray your brush and go back over it. It'll go away. I just, I did. I just did that. Can you use Dixie Bell products like the Patina with other products like DIY paint? I'm sure. But you have to, with the, when you use the Patina, you have to get the iron paint. What? I don't know. I know that you have to do like paint, then spray, then guard. I don't know. I wouldn't say yes and buy all that. I wouldn't spend the money on all the patina line and then waste it on DIY paint if it didn't work. You know what I mean? Like it could work, but I have a bunch. I have a bunch of DIY paint. Yeah, you should try it. it and let let you know. J Po try it before you like spend a bunch of money and then 
waste your stuff. <laughs> Let J-Po try it for us, and then we can tell you. I don't know. I've never, I only use Dixie Bow, so I have no idea. If, ja if Jasmine becomes a Wiseau retailer, I'm going to have so much Dixie Bow DIY and Wiseau paint. It's going to be stupid. <laughs> right. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, so, you know, on my stencils, guess what I want to do? So, the last time I did stencils, so usually I use paint. I've used the sea spray to make a raised stencil. Um, and then uh, the last time I used the uh, gilding waxes to make a copper stencil so it looked like metal. And now I think I'm going to, like, hand paint inside the stencil so it looks like I painted this beautiful flower or maybe I'll just paint a flower I don't know Jpo you look so skinny <gasps> what Dion just <gasps> said you look so skinny you just me she's you know gonna why? be above you know herself why? for the next you know few days you know why no but you know why because I'm winning the weight loss challenge <laughs> <No>. <laughs> because guess who weighed herself this morning Malia and guess who's lost weight what is that? Almost 10 pounds. I don't believe it. So I need now to see I'm a scale. Now, oh, listen, listen. So Nisha was like barely like a half a percent ahead of me. When was that? Wednesday? Yeah. I have lost weight. She was a half a percent ahead of me Wednesday. So I think if she stayed exactly where she has, was at <laughs> and with me losing another pound and a half, now I'm back in the lead. Nisha, I, I was the same as I'm, I was the same. My seven pounds has not gone away. Oh yeah. Me and you were me and you were like neck and neck too. But you haven't lost any more weight, have you? No, I need to. I'm gonna mm. take on some anorexia. You wait. Stop. I'm just joking. It's not funny, I know. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna just start drinking shakes, I think. That's what it is. It's because I drink my shakes. I know. I told you. I'm gonna start drinking shakes. That's what I'm gonna do. Because you're losing weight because you drink okay, shakes I'm, instead of eating. And if I could do that, I'd probably get past that. You, your your husband is not thrilled about your anorexia statement and neither am I'm I. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to drink shakes. So I guess it's, to me it's technically not eating. But I guess it's drinking a shake. It's eating. You get like so much protein. Eating from it. involves eating. That's drinking. You're still nourishing your body, you weirdo. You're still nourishing your body. <laughs> yeah, I want to try that, honestly. Oh, no, I just splattered red paint in my apricot. Dude, I just splattered red okay, paint so in my apricot. It's just paint. Erin, I just stand in front of the camera and no one oh, can wait. see it. Erin, <laughs> that's my psychology. <laughs> just put your face really close. <laughs> drink margaritas cheers <laughs> that's a good idea Carrie so by the time you're here in August like our weight loss challenge because we'll probably do another one I think we talked about doing one in the group because like Carrie thinks she, was it Carrie or Amber thinks she's going to win the next I know time. those girls all want to do group. it yeah well they're not but we'll be done with our weight loss challenges by then so we can have all the cocktails and all the cookies and all the whatever we want I'm not a sweet person, but I do love my salty things. I know you're not sweet. Hey, that's not nice. <laughs> you, <laughs> you set yourself up I'm for that. I'm a sweet person. I just don't <laughs> love sweets as much as I love salty. Like, I'd much rather have some I'm chips. I'm salty as well. <laughs> I'd much rather have chips than I would a brownie. Uh, I'd rather have chocolate. And then some chips, because i got to get rid of the sweet taste. I'm not even a chocolate person in general. <laughs> I'm more of a, like... I know that's so strange. My son's the same way. It's weird. Fruity person. I'm like, are you even my kid? Because it's weird. I'm kind of fruity. <laughs> <laughs> I know that, too. <laughs> I learned that, like, the first week we started talking and being friends. You're welcome. Score's a little nutty. You're welcome. So what are you doing the rest nutty. of your weekend, j -Po? So tomorrow, I'm so excited. Tomorrow, I'm going to go meet my new, my brand new sparkly, shiny nephew. Sparkly, shiny? 
I think they're more like squishy. Brand new baby. They're squishy. Okay, whatever. He's brand new and sparkly and shiny. They smell really good when they're new. And smell. I know I'm gonna go smell on him and cuddle him. <laughs> <laughs> and, and and oh yeah, and I'm gonna go see his my you know, my brother and sister in law. Them too, you know, whatever. <laughs> whatever. You know how it is when you have a baby, nobody cares about you anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Cause there's a cute little baby in the house. So that's what we're doing tomorrow. Today, the rest of the day, you know what? Today I'm gonna move. I've got to stage my buffet. Yeah. So I'm probably gonna do that here in a little bit. I'm gonna stage my buffet and then I'm gonna move out. You're gonna move out? Does, does uh, Bobby know? Yeah. Oh. I'm moving out all of my furniture. Well, he's gonna and notice that that happened. In my... <laughs> Can I talk yeah, now? Go ahead. Is it my turn? Okay. All the furniture in my paint studio, I'm moving to the to, to the storage place. Like, not the storage place, but like we store everything in the garage and then we cover yeah. it. The done ones or the oh, undone ones? ones? The done ones. And then I'm gonna bring in that massive dresser that goes with this sucker. Yeah in here so when, when I'm ready it's like here for me so I gotta stage my buffet first but I gotta go back to the hardware store because I got the wrong thinking screw <laughs> I remember that good thing you guys we talk a little bit during the day sometimes a little bit a little bit okay I like this dry brushing but I have to keep going back and forth between colors to get it how I want it which is fine but yep I'm liking it it looks let me see cool. It kind of looks like a backwards of your fake distressing. Does that make sense? Yeah. Look at mine. It's coming along. That's just wet. It's not white right there. I don't know why it looks like that in the light. But Carrie says she's in for the next one. Carrie, remind me where you are because the next one will be in Kansas. Next one will be in the Kansas. Um, unless, unless. The clients have already moved to Texas by then. I don't think it's going to happen. It might happen. No. Nope. You're going to fall in love with West Texas. No. <clears throat> I know you're playing on swooning me, but no. And we're Fourteen gonna, me. Um, um, on Monday before y'all leave, we're going to go look at houses. <laughs> we're going to go look at houses. She's probably set up a realtor, guys. Realtor. It's not even a joke. She I've probably did. Like a realtor. Like we <laughs> We have a legit realtor we've used like 72 times. And she's like, I've got, I got you. Need a job first, then I, I come in. We've so much. Carrie, I know this gig, furniture painting. Maybe you heard of it? I don't know. Try it out. <laughs> Try out, girls. Um, and we're also, Carrie, speaking of Carrie Fox, we will be, um, Jennifer and I, each are being interviewed on her page. I don't know, like, what what people are going to think that we have that's interesting to talk about, but we're going to be interviewed, guys. That's her. For Gil, I'm actually going to be on 10 Ken Monday. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be on 10 Ken Monday, Gail Tyler. Oh, yeah, mm -hmm. that's right. We got her too. Oh, yeah, because she's doing more of an interview. Carrie, Carrie and us are going to be more of, like, a paint she's, show. Just one time. Yeah, like a she's fun doing Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Fun day. That's right. That's a yeah. Sunday fun day. Gail's the interview. We'll be working on projects. Yeah. Carrie's is a project thing. It's Gail's better. is like a more of an interview style. <sighs> it's so exciting, guys. See how cool and fun it is to get to go on people that are in our group, get to go live on their pages with them and do things like so much fun. So if you're in our group and you ever want to go live with one of us, hit us up because we find that super fun. And it's enjoyable to get to go get to know you guys better and going live on your guys' pages. Mm -hmm. JPO has said that there's a limit to how much she'll allow me to do this because she's a little bit um possessive. <laughs> your ear pods a lot. So she's like, you can't go all the time on people's pages, just like once or once in a while. <laughs> Pretty sure it's the other way. <laughs> okay. JK, LOL. I kind of been a stopping. Oh, I could dry it with my heat gun, huh? Gosh, I love that thing. 
I can dry it with my heat gun, yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Um, my incense is still. I feel like it's going to take me 100 years to do this entire bedroom set at this rate. Well, oh, wait, that's the wrong brush. Welcome to my world, I guess, huh? <laughs> I, just, I just pulled a carry. I just pulled a carry. Sorry, I grabbed the wrong brush. I grabbed the wrong, I grabbed the wrong brush. Carrie, I'm not making fun of you. I'm laughing <laughs> with you. In our practice game show. <laughs> um, just pulling a Malia by adding too much detail where you take a long time. It's kind of my MO. It's kind of my She MO. overanalyzes. Oh. Can we can we just talk about how long it took us to do our dang event on our website? That is really loud. Really loud. Too loud? Sorry. Take your earbuds out and just put them in your hand or something. And I'll talk. That's it. That's it. Okay. okay. Wait. Put them back Wait. in. Put them back in. There's an echo. Undo it. There was an echo when you took them out. Just go. Just go. We'll no, no, I feel it. guilty. I'm just sit here and drink no, my cocktail. <laughs> Aaron, like a mom, turn that racket down. We can wrap it up. <laughs> you hear Aaron? Turn that racket right. down. No, go ahead. It's fine. It won't take long. It won't take nope. long. No. Nope. Oh, no. We could be done by now. Just no, because then I'm going to have to, I'm going to the next Get phase, a, and I don't even know plate. what time it is. What time is it? It's 1.45. It's 1.45. I want to mess up my incense on top burning. Oh, good grief. Just get your dang gun out. And I'll just continue to dry brush. Nope. Not going to do it. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Grape I tossed it. Jeez Louise. That's what I did earlier. I know. That's what you're setting me up for. Failure. No. So what I was saying what was, happened was, can we just talk about how long what happened was, can we just talk about how long it took us to set up our event on our website because somebody was looking at it, all the fonts and all the colors and all the backgrounds and all the buttons and all, I'm like, we are artists. The color and backgrounds one. and fonts should be our jam. But no, j was like, just whip that B out, put some typewriter font on it and go. And I'm like, it needs to be the colors I of our shirt. Typewriter. And mine's not. Because I'm a rebel. Mine's purple. It's okay, Carrie. I'm doing it with my styrofoam plate. I don't mind suffering for the better good of the greater. All right. The better good of the greater. <laughs> yeah. I don't really know what my next step um, is anyway. I don't know what my next step is anyway. So, wait a second. I'm going to spray this with some vinegar. So, if I'm doing this, have the perfect piece to grunge waiting for our event, Em. Yeah, Carrie. I love that. So, if I go in and put some stencils on here and I'm wanting to hand paint the stencils, how the heck do I do that? I take a little pencil and just outline all of that. You're wanting to hand paint it, like with a brush? Yeah. Just, just put a basic. Oh, I like, can just do that with the brush. Dab it with huh? your finger. I see what you're saying. Like, take a brush and go in and just start doing it. No, well, no, that's not what I was gonna say. What I okay, listen. You know that dresser that you named Guns and Roses? Yeah. Those were stamps. What I though. did, because I. Listen to me, Linda. <laughs> I'm listening. What what I did was I actually stamped those with a very light gray or blue or something. I don't even remember. It was a very, very light color. And then I painted over it with the colors that I wanted. Just use your paintbrush and outline stencil and work there. Yeah. Either way. Or use your little finger and just dab it to where it's very light. Okay, fine. You like, to, you like to use your fingers anyways. You know I do. You know I do. What do I want to make that? Okay. 
So I'm going to pull some colors off the shelf because I didn't plan this out really well. Okay, so maybe I'll use a couple of colors of green. I'm thinking some colors of green for the leaves, right? And a stem color. See, most people would just use a transfer, but no, I like to make things difficult. Better not be making no faces right now. I would never not believe you. I don't believe you. Do I need buttercream? I'm innocent. Buttercream. Putting 75 colors down. I'm innocent until proven guilty. Until you watch the replay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna use maybe some mermaid tail and some kudzu, kudzu, and some holy guacamole maybe for my leaves and such. And then, and such. Um, yeah, my God-given tool, my hands. <laughs> I said down the Dixville page. <laughs> I was like, use my fingers. I was given by Jesus when I was born. <laughs> All these people wrote me and asked me about that. <laughs> That's funny. Well, you know. Um, I need to probably tape those like a regular smart people do. They tape things. <sighs> Clearly, I was not prepared for this point. Oh, my gosh. What happened? Why is it all wet? What? What's all wet? My stencil. Oh, from laying it on the ground, and I have like overspray of vinegar and water on the ground. Jeez Louise, I worked that too, way too, Carrie. Thank you, Carrie. Makes me feel better. Just gotta find my tape. Here we go. Well, that's probably not a good idea. Gotta use that blue tape, eh? I, I just grabbed like the packing tape. <laughs> yeah, I don't do that. It's not a good idea. Wait, are you already packing the, to move to Texas? Do what? No. Are you already packing to move to Texas? No. no. Nice try though. What are you doing with this piece, Malia? Um, so she don't know. Yeah, <laughs> she goes. Never mind. It's all simple. <laughs> I'm doing a bunch of rust, though. I'm using the Dixie Belle Patina line to make a bunch of rusty stuff. And then, of course, I'm going to use a bunch of Dixie Belle dirt and their charcoal color. And we know I'll use wax and probably some gilding wax. Oh, I'm going to use red wax. They're red gilding wax. I'm so excited to use this. It's called Anastasia. Whoa. Anastasia. We can't really see the color, but we believe what you It's said. red. It's really pretty. When you do your event, you need a portion of the event where every 20 minutes you switch and work on the other person's piece. Oh, the fun you would have. What? I don't want her messing up my piece. <gasps> oh, my gosh. You can even imagine what that would be like. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even, I'm not even going to pretend that I'm even close to the greatness of artistry that Malia claims. Oh my gosh, did you just say that? Oh wait, did I compliment you? I take it back. You're Let's amazing. Rewind. Check your face hole. Now I'm like fluttered. Wow. You are an well, amazing artist. Well, thank you very much, but you that. you're ridiculous. You're an amazing artist. And I can only imagine what our... We'd probably try way harder at each other's pieces than we would be our own. <laughs> so it'd probably turn out really I would good. Fail mi I would fail miserably at your techniques. I well, we wouldn't have to do... I feel like I would fail He's miserably. not saying we would do each other's techniques. He's saying, like, we would do our technique on do each other's spin. pieces. Oh. That's what he's saying. So I'd come in and do my, my blending stuff on your... Mm -hmm. On my stencils <laughs> and my, yes. my, grunge, my grunge wax. <laughs> Okay, so you would come in and grunge out my blending. <laughs> I put wash, paint washes on everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
The only problem is that's kind of a neat idea though. Is that JPO makes everything really classy, and I make everything really like it came out of your grandma's basement yesterday or attic. <laughs> so I don't know how that would go together. My stuff is not classy. Your stuff is super classy not and pretty. Not everything I do is classy. Yours looks like it came out of some rich person's oh, mansion yeah. yesterday. Mine looks like it came out of the oh, basement. Shut <laughs> <laughs> or shut out crazy. in the garden for 10 years. <laughs> okay, you need, really need to quit talking about my friend that way. I'm going to get a little bit annoyed. <laughs> you're, you're ridiculous. I wonder if that's good enough to hold it down. This could okay, be I learned on, my, on the other side of this piece that I have to let it dry before I start dry brushing because I, I thought well, I told you that the, some pieces Gosh. I thought I was not done talking uh, I thought that maybe with some of the areas being a little bit wet like it would blend a little bit and look kind of cool it doesn't <laughs> it doesn't <laughs> it doesn't but what I did was when I was done with this yeah I spritzed it I spritzed it with the vinegar water it looks really cool well, there you go. I really have only used vinegar water for like really, 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 really distressed looks. Not like a, just a real gentle right. misting. I think that's probably a fair statement. Okay. So, so now that you're starting on your next step, like I'm done. I told you, that's why I wasn't going to start it yet. Look how crazy that looks. Maybe I'll do this on the zoom in in our group. Yeah, do that. Go in. Because it's actually almost two anyways. All right, guys. So um, <laughs> go to our uh, group link if you want to sign up for our group. And then um, on June 1st, and then you'll be able to see media this campaign is simple in <laughs> our group. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. So anyways, when you get off here, what we need you to do is one thing. Click on that link she has pinned right there on the top and come to our event. Click it. FOMO is a real thing. Don't let it yeah, kick in. Just join. Come so in. So like, yes. Yeah, so just like, yeah, just like super quick. It's August 24th. It's it's in Fort Sand, Texas, which is about like a 10 minute drive from Big Spring from where I'm at. Um, both of us will be painting a piece of furniture each, two different techniques. Uh, your ticket includes lunch. Um cocktails and if you're the first 20 to book you get a free t-shirt and you'll have the opportunity we'll have like raffle tickets there for like 10 bucks if you want to just put in one raffle ticket um you have the opportunity to win one of our pieces of furniture or if you're flying in which we have several ladies flying in and you don't want to ship shipping is available because i do actually i met a really cool shipper guy he's super awesome actually sounds like a romance um Anywho, we'll have a, an alternate um, an, an alternate package that you can win. We've got a gal that's going to donate some paint pixie brushes. I'm actually going to donate some paint. Leah's going to bring some stuff. Um, so we'll have an alternate package there. So that's just like the general overview of the paint show. August 24th here in Texas. Um, for, shout out to the Four Sand Oil Patch Cafe. Really cool little spot. Um, so yeah, your ticket gets lunch, cocktails, a shirt if you're first 20. Two artists, two techniques, two pieces of furniture you possibly win. Book now, limited seats. Okay. That was super fast and effective. Thank you. You're welcome. I just I didn't want to do it the Malia way where it took 30 minutes. I'm highly passionate I mean, personality, okay? People appreciate it. And doggone it, people like me. <laughs> I'm just giving you a hard time. I know. I'm just giving you a hard time. Um, so yeah, I think that's it. We need to we'll go ahead and sign off. It's almost two o'clock, and you look like you're really into what you're doing. If it's stormy there, and you're like in your head, I am. It's stormy and in my head. head. My incense is about to burn out. I'm gonna have to start another one. Do you boo? Do you Do boo? You boo? Do you boo? Do you boo? All right. Next week. Wait, what's next week? What is the date next this week? Month. It's Memorial Day weekend, right? Next week. I don't even know what day of the week it is. Much less so. what holiday it is. It's Saturday because we're doing our oh, show. Okay. Hey, Kim. Kim, come see us in Texas for our paint show. Live in-person class. Okay, give me a fist pump. The link's right there. Boom. Boom.
Boom. <laughs> All right. See y'all next Saturday for another fabulous episode of Color Me Pretty. Her page, Bye, guys. Central Standard Time. Love Bye. you, love you, show.